So here we have an alarm clock slash phone charger slash Bluetooth slash radio. And outside the box, it actually comes with its own charger. So let's say that a power outage went out. You have the bay for batteries. So you do not even need the wire. You can just go run on it with batteries. So on the top, the buttons are self-explanatory. As you can see, there's actually a, a button for an alarm setting actual alarm where you can actually set it to military time which is right now at 12 hours but holding the button can actually set it to military time for 24 hours the next button is snooze so when your alarm goes off you actually press on it to snooze it and you can actually change the brightness of the clock as you can see if i click it a couple of times it would change the brightness of the viewpoint it can go to the brightest and it can go to the lowest and in the last button, you have the Bluetooth and the radio. You can actually press it to actually turn off the radio or turn on the radio. This knob actually changes the time if you're, let's say your clock, daylight savings, and you have to change the hour. So the knob actually can change the time or even the radio station that you're listening to. And you can even press it to actually set the time or to set the radio. On the first knob, you can actually change the volume of the radio. So the actual charger is a DC charger. And on the back, you can see it has an A type and a C type to plug in to charge other things besides your phone. And for here, you can charge Galaxy phones, iPhones, and you just can place it on top. It can actually charge with the case, so that's what's good about it. Now, to turn on the radio, all you have to do is press this button, and that's the Bluetooth sound, meaning it's trying to find the Bluetooth. But clicking on the radio, you can actually turn up the volume. And as you can see on the screen, it actually tells you that it's turning up the volume. And to change the radio, you have to do this. It might actually take a while to find a station that you like, but you'll eventually find one. So when I click on the alarm settings, it actually tells you if it's off or on. You can have up to two alarm, alarm set up. So as you can see, the alarm goes off and it's actually a really soothe, soothing sound to wake up to. Not so abruptly like an iPhone would have or as startling as most alarm clocks have. And to snooze it, all you have to do is click the snooze button. 